Do it. Yeah, that's really cool. I think you're biased by the sun. Sorry? Yeah, it's going to come behind us, I guess. On this side. Yeah, it's going to be pretty. Plug in the shower head. There we go. It's just a push. Hey guys, thanks for reading here. So I'm Nick and Mathilde is behind the camera filming. There she is. And I hope you're doing all well. So this is another episode. A lot of you have asked us how we set up camp and what it looks like. 
and so we're gonna go and jump into it right now so for tonight we did find ourselves a really sweet spot here in the Yukon Canada uh, not on I Overlander completely well we just found it on uh, Google Maps and our map out and so we thought it would be a perfect setting to show you how we set up camp so we've already set everything up but I'm going to show you real quick uh, what we have so we do have the exterior table that fits directly on the car and here there are two little mounts which go directly on the vehicle's uh, side bump. We do have then the two camping chair and usually we eat dinner here, cook dinner and then just relax on our computers or just chat. Uh, we haven't played cards yet on it but maybe next time. Um, sometimes we take out this uh, table, this table from uh, Rough Parts, we got in Switzerland. Sometimes we take out this table because it's just so easy to just be chopping stuff and not have a whole table full of uh, materials. So sometimes we use this table. Coming towards the back, the trash -a -roo. So we just keep the trash open, boom. Last thing we ate, Snickers. That's easy to see. And we just throw it in there. We do set up our shower tent. And of course, having the shower with the view directly on the lake, the mountains, and the sun. Perfect way to enjoy an awesome shower in the wild and for free because we do have our own water and it's hot water. Look at that, good pressure too. And um, so we've got the little soaps in here and the little mat on the floor so you're not getting all the mud on your feet because that's kind of annoying. So it's kind of good. This is the Cathlon, so pretty good. This is the hose it comes out from, so directly in the car, usually we put it like this so that it doesn't bother us too much while we're walking back in front. And, and the table that you just saw is actually the flooring of the car. So we remove the flooring and we set it up over there. That's all we have to do. In the front of the car, we had this bag. And this is where we kept the camping chairs and the tent for the shower. So everything just came out of there. And that's actually it. Then, of course, we go into the car and we just pick out everything we need for the evening. And we have here all the food. So this is where we get the food out. The fridge is over there. And we have then the cooker. And the cooker is actually a Coleman, uh, which is a double stove. And I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like right now. This is where we keep our double stove from Pullman. Okay. And what's really neat about this double stove is it works with unleaded fuel you have then double stoves so that's what we use for all of our cooking and what's great it comes into this metal box so it's super easy i think that's about everything in our setup when we set up camp and it takes us about 10 minutes 15 minutes max yeah it's actually that fast the only thing then is everything's a bit slower in terms of cooking showering because when you shower and you turn on the water you go back into the car to dry up and uh, these are all things that take a bit more time than in a normal home, but it's still very fast. And the cooking, the same, you know, everything comes out of the cupboard there, bring it out here, cut it up, cook it, and then dishwashing, either we use the hose of the shower or we use the other hose we have on the other side of the car, which we can use it for cleaning the dishes. And that's about it in terms of the setup. What's for dinner? Um, not Doritos. A uh, dal lentil dal. Lentil dal with onions, sweet potato. Look at this sunset. So beautiful. 